What's a candy you never have been able to get on board with? I've read some horror stories about sugar-free gummy bears. So I naturally avoid them at all costs. Their demeanor is inviting. But beware. And labeled chocolates. That goo that came in a clear toothpaste tube. I have no idea if they even make it anymore. But it was everywhere in the 90s. That ribbon candy in grandma's dish with an inch of dust on it. Those shit ass generic things from trick or treat bags of yesteria. I never knew what they were because the orange or black wax paper wrappers were blank. They were hard chewy and dense. Not in a good way. And most of the time when you unwrap them. The candy had fused to part of the wrapper, so you were eating some wax paper as you chewed up this unsatisfying nugget of dental filling thievery. Each year you'd get down to the dregs of your bag and all that was left were these, and plain mini Hershey's. And when even the plain mini Hershey's were gone you still didn't want these. But you'd try one anyway, like it had gotten better since last year but it hadn't. And one was all it took, and you threw out the rest of them, and wished you could remember which old person neighbor house gave these crap things out, so you could skip them next year. Garbage candy. Wax lips. Those cheap hollow chocolate figurines of Santa. The Easter Bunny. ETC. That you get on holidays. They're usually made from the worst quality chocolate. So thin that it just crumbles into itself, when you bite into it, or break a piece off. And there isn't even that much chocolate since it's hollow. Those dot candies on the parchment paper. I inadvertently end up eating mostly the parchment paper. Thrills. Purple gum that tastes like fucking dish soap. Fuck right off. The candy hearts that you get around Valentine's Day. Sugar flavored chalk. I'm out. That purple ass gum. Spice flavor jelly beans. My grandmother always put them in our Easter basket and they were disgusting. Fucking circus peanuts. What the hell is wrong with people? Good and plenty. It's sold everywhere. Yet I've never seen anyone buy it. Black licorice. I'm from Japan. We eat bunch of out there stuff but this, I can't get on board with. If they had presented it as some kind of medicine I might have been okay with it. Edit, never have I ever imagined black licorice to be the reason for my first awards. Thank you kind people on reddit. Colon close bracket. Jujubes. Tiny. Semi hard. And stuck in all your teeth. Circus peanuts. Necco wafers. How were these popular? I guess back then it was 100% socially acceptable to beat your kids. But child abuse via Necco wafer is too much. Chalky wedding mints. I had a bad experience with them when I was 5. I ate way, way too many of them and cake and punch at my mother's third wedding. I woke up in the middle of the night and vomited all over. Samiyaki. As if black licorice weren't bad enough by itself. The Nordic peoples, for some insane reason, decided to add salt to it 